Five years ago, an explosion at Flower Branch Apartments in Silver Spring left seven people dead and 65 injured. On Tuesday, local leaders came together to remember the lives that were lost on that summer night in 2016. It's our responsibility to make sure that we always remember what happened and remember what's an issue of negligence. Montgomery County Council Member Will Jawanda was among those in attendance. We are going to remember what happened five years ago today when these seven souls, two children, were killed in a preventable tragedy. Still here today, five years later, we all still feel it because we, we miss our loved ones, we miss those who died, and we remember what happened. According to an investigation done by the National Transportation Safety Board, the cause of the explosion was an abnormality in a mercury service regulator. Recently, state politicians had a small victory in preventing these tragedies from happening. Despite Washington gas fighting against us, we succeeded in passing one of the safety measures that had come about as a result of the NTSB investigation here, and that was to to put the, um, the, the regulators, the gas regulators, outside of new buildings and to move them outside of all multifamily buildings over the next several years. While the lives that were lost cannot be replaced, local leaders will continue to advocate and remember them. We will not stop until everyone in Montgomery County has a safe, affordable, habitable home in their community. We will not stop. People disappear is when they don't have nobody who remember them. And we are going always to be right over here every year, remember these seven beautiful people. Reporting in Silver Spring, Michael Hernandez for my MCM. If you find our videos useful to you, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel.